Hello? Did that do anything? <clears throat> yeah, oh my god. Brrr, okay. Okay, okay. I'm glad. Thank you. God. I said stuff. <laughs> I said a lot of stuff before I became unmuted. Oops. Let's start from the top, shall we? Ice cream, ice cream, ice cream, ice cream. My mic is muted, really? Blah 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 blah. I read all this stuff. <laughs> I read all of this stuff, unfortunately. And did I get my photos printed? What photos? Are you playing an, a, a jupe? A jake? A jape on me? Sorry. <laughs> my photos have not been printed. Unless I've specified something that I have no clue about. <laughs> anyway, though, welcome. Welcome, all. Thank you for the follow of fragilities. <clears throat> I hope you're not a bot, because I hear that's been a thing that's uh, recent now. A bunch of bots. I don't know whether to be intrigued or repulsed. I forgot there was audio. <laughs> Is that too loud? <clears throat> Hold up. Let me fix that. Start of stream audio fixing. There we go. Mm. So last time we Basically, the internet, like, took over this digital space. Something about a respect for living things, or the opposite. You remember this, right? <clears throat> what? Hey, find me. <laughs> okay. Maybe I have to read. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Uh, 
Let's start with the... With the, the shop on the other side. Um, 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 um. We go east. Because that's... That's where the inconvenient store is. <clears throat> As you arrive at the desolate street corner, a devastating aftershock tears through reality, ripping Bosco's e-convenience from its very foundation. The contents of the store begin to spill out of the front door. You see a blue slime, 28 potions, and a hot rump fall... <laughs> Lost forever! After a moment, an AI Bosco slowly comes sliding out of the door, muttering, It does work. Trusted me, trusted me. As he plummets out of sight. You see a Bosco's e convenience here. The Bosco's is empty. Uh, can we go in? Nope. Mm. It's just floating in front of us. <laughs> I'm not sure that information is necessary at this juncture, Max. Oh, right. All oh, right. I remember what we were doing. We had a plus two sword and we were like going to the other side of the street and doing all that kind of stuff. Can I get anything? Taken. Rules are for marking straight lines and lesser mortals. Mmm. Let's see. Now that we have- wait. You already have a boss ghost. <laughs> huh. Okay. Let's go back this way. And the internet is here. It has lost its respect for living things. You see a respect for living things here. Well... As you reach for the respect of living things, there's a terrible tremor and a giant crack tears apart the sidewalk. The respect for living things slides jelly-like into the resulting chasm. I knew it wasn't gonna be that easy. I never cease to be impressed by your unwavering <laughs> optimism, Max. Ah... Uh. The internet is here, angrily filling out internet polls at its blah 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 blah. Let's let's go down. <clears throat> I forgot that this part, you know, the special parts of the chapters are always the hardest for me. Um, this is the part where a shambling corporate presence eats the respect for living things. <laughs> it makes sense, right? Uh, well... How about we use our thingy? Wait... Wow. <laughs> wow. Sorry. <clears throat> Let's use the boss goes with the corporate presence so that it can swallow small pr 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 proprietorships. <laughs> you throw Bosco's shop in front of the shambling corporate presence, which quickly swallows it up. It looks quite pleased, but only for a moment. Then it resumes sniffing around for something else to eat. Well, that was anticlimactic. You are in a gloomy pit of darkness beneath the street. Carcasses of small businesses lie here, gutted and mauled. A shambling corporate presence is here. Could I possibly... get... it? Okay. <laughs> you know the deal, Max. We have to go through all the plans in order before we get to complete nuclear Oh, lord. <laughs> How about go libertarian? <laughs> you can't. Maybe this isn't the best time to uh, affiliations. I never affiliate with anyone who isn't prepared to drown me in money. 
I was thinking we would go back up and get another boss hose. Maybe the idea is to fill the shambling corporate presence with so many small businesses that it explodes or something. That makes sense, right? Let's get it. Taken. Convenience stores are the way <laughs> the you see a Bosco's buy-in sprint floating here? Alright, so we do do this because it changed. Whenever in point and clicks or text adventures or whatever, when the outcome changes, you must be doing something right. Let's go down. Ooh. <laughs> ah, Neve. Hi, hi. <coughs> Welcome. Sorry I couldn't come to your stream, by the way. I slept at 7 a.m. <laughs> I was kind of like in waiting in the wings, shall we say. But I succumbed to my sleep. And I woke up late for my own stream. Burp. Burp, 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 burp. Let's use this. On this. You throw Bosco shop in front of the shambling corporate presence, which quickly swallows it up. It looks quite pleased, and it does the same well, thing. Maybe I need a super small business. <laughs> let's see, let's see. <clears throat> If I keep, like, alt-tabbing to check the chat, uh, my bad. My mom took my phone. <laughs> and I, I do, I, um, uh, I have a TV in my room so I can set up, like, dual monitors, but... <laughs> eh. I mean, I would love to, but I'm lazy. And I'd rather just use my phone if ever... Let's get it. Taken. Strange paranoia that I've just been wasting all these stores. Using things once and disposing of them haphazardly is downright patriotic of you, Sam. <laughs> well, was it booze and smokes before? No, it wasn't. It was something like spir spirits. Bet. <clears throat> Maybe. Let's go back. Well, hold on. Before we do that, maybe... Maybe I can get around this big thing. The huge hulking corporate presence shambles low to the ground, snuffling for something to satiate its hunger. Yeah, we can't really go anywhere but here, so, uh... Eat another lovely corporation. Go! Well, that was anticlimactic. Okay, I don't think it's working. It's been three times and it didn't happen, so... We're doing something else. <clears throat> Ta -dong. Let's just get another boss goes just in case- huh? Oh. You and me both, little buddy. <laughs> Let's get one more business for good venture. Uh, bit good measure. <laughs> well, that warped at least fifty different rules of physics. Rules are for marking. Oops. <laughs> you see a Bosco's junk corner floating. Well, they are getting like lower and lower in quality, right? It must be doing something. It went from a booze store to a do to a do to a junk corner. Hmm. Let's see. Let's try checking out Sybil's place. I know we couldn't really get anything because it was just like a a puddle of kittens. It's the r slash aw side of the internet. Mmm, let's see. Northwest. Ta -dong. Wait, is this the infamous sleepy tan voice? Mm -hmm. Morning voice, I guess. <clears throat> I mean, if it's really me, sleepy me, it would have to be at a, a stream where I've streamed for like 
more than three hours because <laughs> then I'm just like, oh, okay, let's go. <laughs> Let me try this level again, thanks. <laughs> um, so yeah, there are so many kittens on the floor. Among this, we see a card and a big idol that I can't pick up because I tried a while ago. Oh, the cuteness the kittens are losing makes them a little slippery and hard to catch. <laughs> Just leave them here. I thought you always wanted a kitten. <laughs> Let's see what this is. It's from the ultra popular collectible card game Flash Cush. Ka, huh? Hmm? Huh? Cash Flush. <laughs> but it's also foil, making it doubly attractive to hardcore collectors and doubly confusing to everyone else. Huh. Pokemon, am I right? It's never too late to start an expensive and potentially habit forming hobby. Uh -huh. <laughs> um let's try uh, I can't really pick up a lake, can I? Let's get the card. Ooh, give it here. What for? It's rare and it's foiled. I must have it. <laughs> okay. How about this is a little forbidden. But, you begin to bring down the sword on the kittens, but one of the lovable scams curls up on your foot in the perfect imitation of a mind-numbingly cute cashew, <laughs> and you forget what you were doing. Good. <laughs> Sorry I forget. <laughs> I forgot. Mm, well, kittens idol. We have... Bosco's in a real f Okay. Maybe there's something on the street we can... Do you think the internet would like a rare foil card? <laughs> uh... No, 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 no. This? On this? Oh. Just a <laughs> piece of detritus. Created and given artificial value by your despicable creatures. Hey, I resemble that remark. Ouch. Oh, you a little money. It's just bitter over the whole opposable thumbs debacle. Curse you and all your digits. What? You'd bet you'd think she'd have a bunch of digits too. Let's see. The internet is here. Hey, you can't get me. Just kidding. Okay. <laughs> Hmm, does the internet care about small business? Nope. Oops. Hmm, let's try... Wait. No, 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 there's no one in the boss goes right? <clears throat> uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Well, what if we just give- wait, 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 wait. <clears throat> Let's just give this first, just in case something happens. No. Well, that was <laughs> hmm. Let's try the fo- oops. Well. You wave your plus two sword at the shambling corporate presence in a threatening manner. The shambling corporate presence looks at you in irritation and tries to take a bite out of the sword. Nice one, <laughs> How about foil card? It doesn't like it. How about foil card for you? Want this card? Yeah, gimme gimme! <laughs> that doesn't sound healthy. I only hope we live long enough for you to regret this. Oh. Hmm. Well, let's go. The only idea I have is so I keep doing the thing in hopes that it'll work. <laughs> oh, sleepy ten, best ten. Well, oh wait, wrong way. I mean, I'm kind of waking up now. A little bit of energy. 
I didn't mean to go this way, sorry. Kittens. Mm -mm. Go here. <clears throat> okay, let's get the boss goes. Collapsible convenience stores are the way of Yes. No, it went back to e-convenience. Oh, my hubris. <laughs> Excuse me. Can I not get another one? No. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, what if I give the store the card? Nope. <laughs> Hmm. Do you think kittens would be interested in rare foil cards? <laughs> Wait. Oh, okay. Hmm. They can't occupy the same space at the same time. Because that's against the laws of physics that we are currently breaking. <laughs> oh goody! Now I can use it as a convenient front to make a fortune selling weapons of suspect origin in bulk to third world countries. You're the president. Wow. Oh right. I guess I don't need a front then. You can keep it. Ha <laughs> 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 ha. Let's try going to Sybils, which is northwest. Ooh. I didn't know I could fast forward it. I think. <clears throat> so. Why don't I get the idol? I really don't so want it. Too, actually. Listen hmm. to the nice virtual world, Sam. It's trying to help. I kind of do want it though, now that you say that. Now that you give me different text. Oops. Uh burp, burp, burp. Okay. Oh, really? Come on, Sam, just hand over the Wait. Does it have a use for a boss ghost, however? It says it crusted. <laughs> well, <we> Thanks. <clears> hmm. <throat> I'm gonna have to use my brain. What if I hit it? Hit it. Oh. <laughs> What if I hit it again? No, it doesn't do anything. <laughs> Did I already try to offer it a convenience store? Oh, yes, I did. Okay, well, let's put the convenience store in the pile of cuteness, I guess. Maybe it'll do something that I don't expect. Oops, well... Uh, oh, you know, you don't expect the convenience store to serve as a sponge. <laughs> okay, well, we have this now. What if we feed this to the big shambling corporate presence? And then, you know, the big corporate presence can become all cute and have its profile picture be rainbows for a month. You know, in an attempt. Hello. Eat my gay boss ghost. <laughs> it happily devours it. It then looks a little green around the gills. It begins to retch and cough. Finally, it vomits up a respect for living things, as well as half a dozen small knickknack stores that we painstakingly gave it, and coffee shops. Well, that was a vulgar display. <clears throat> oh, we have it. Let's get the respect for living things. Um, ew. <laughs> and let's, uh, no, no, no. Let's go back up. Now we just give it to the internet, I assume. Let's see. Use respect on internet. 
The internet grasps it tight about beep boop and looks you right in the eye. I'm sorry. Oh. Well. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how many hours we get. Have you got any one ups? You are not dead. Oh, okay. Okay. You know, now that I think about it, if this is over, that was relatively simple. Haha. Uh -oh. No, the porn. This never would have happened if he hadn't tricked me. Who? Well, you won't have this sentient global network to kick around. Oh. Who's Roy G. Biv? Oh. Didn't we meet them already? Hmm. Wasn't he the rainbow guy? Or did he just spit out Roy G. Biv's? The most vital piece of information. It's the internet. What did you expect? Good point. <laughs> Nevertheless, we'll find you, Roy G. Biv. Whoever you are, wherever you are. Can it wait until after we get some lunch? Of course. There's a place over on Second where they serve deep-fried chocolate pork belly donuts. Do you think we can get a discount wow. from the President of the United States? Good gravy, are you still? Oh my God, it's Majora's Mask. <laughs> it's Costco's Majora's Mask over here. Actually, I don't know what I'm talking about. Is Costco's good? Anyway, we beat it. Oh! <laughs> I'm gonna lurk for a bit because I'm doing some. Hey, okay, okay. Good luck with what you're doing. What you're doing. Good. We did it. That was chapter 5. Now we're on the last chapter, which is very cool. ta -da! Bright side of the moon. Oh, I guess where we're going. <laughs> What started out as a global mi local mind control scheme has grown to global proportions. And Sam and Max are off to the moon to save the entire planet from a lifetime of hypnotic enslavement. But when chaos collides with tranquility, have the freelance police finally met their match? We'll find out. I always forget this is a telltale. We'll find a complimentary government issued aerosol can waiting in the mailbox. Get to spray in America. Let's heat this mother up. <laughs> this has been an announcement from the President of the United States. <laughs> give, Sam. You missed your cue. What? Oh, sorry, little buddy in chief. I'm still thinking about our last case. The internet said it was working for somebody named Roy G. Biv. Obviously a pseudonym, but for who? For whom? We're detectives, Sam, not mind the readers. Moon. Hey, maybe we should ask you Blitz. Mind readers, that's it. No, that's not it. By the way, have you seen my copy of Emetics, the Handbook for Multicolored Happiness by Hugh Blitz? Colors. <laughs> oh, think, Max, think. Well, I know I had it this morning. That's it. Morning. In the ancient tongue of the mud-worshipping Kapalahutek tribe of the Serengeti, our word morning means heat who destroys the hypnotic rainbow man. What? That's the word he fears the most. So this Roy G. Biv is the one person we've met who's never said the word morning. That means it's... What? It's <laughs> Commissioner? I never did trust him. No, Chowderhead. It's Hugh Bliss. Never! What? Huh? Oh, Commissioner, I didn't mean... Look, I need you to put out an APB on Hugh Bliss. Stat. By the Greek god of <coughs> Selene in a chariot with dual overhead cams and silver fox mud flaps. We're on our way. Let's go, Max. The Commissioner said that Hugh Bliss is currently staying at his exclusive prismatology retreat. The blister. Okay, okay, okay. You know, I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> If, like, all the other characters actually did say the word morning, and he's the only one that didn't. <laughs> That's what I expect from games like this. <laughs> Exciting, huh? Yeah, 
so this is the last chapter. It'll probably be like an hour or two. Then I'll be done with Sam and Max. Wah! Then I can move on to the older ones. Or the newer one if... No. I'm not sure if this is the most recent one. Or... Or what? <laughs> But I do want to play more. <clears throat> I'm always interested in the evolution of like point and clicks. Kind of like Space Quest. I have it, but I haven't played it yet, but I will. So we're on the moon. Feels good to be back on the moon, doesn't it? We made good time, too. We've still got plenty of generic brand powdered orange flavored drink mix left. You always did know how not there's only 25 states. What are we doing first, Sam? Let's locate the blister of tranquility, find out what you bliss is up to, and arrest his unprincipled magical butt. Is that a visitor center? <laughs> what? Wow, I can't believe it. A visitor center on the moon. Whoa, cute. It looks cleaner from far away. It also looks like it's made of paper. Oh. I pressed spacebar to jump. My bad. Well, well. Aren't you Teddy Bear? Once upon a time, but no longer. Who are you now? I've gone back to being Harry Mole Man. Cosmetology <laughs> has helped me find a new me where the old one used to be. Uh, did he? I can't remember if he had eyes, had eyes before or not. He was a criminal. I don't remember anything about you. Only in the spiritual sense. Prismatology helped me put Harry Mole Man back together again. Mm. Looks like you may have left out a few pieces by mistake. So he did be short. I used to use that exoskeleton, but prismatology is Exo <gasps> Did I miss something big? Maybe Maybe I like blacked out for like seven chapters of this game. And there's only six. Actually, I'm still a little sore that he tried to get you to shoot me last time we saw him. I'm channeling my saturation towards making amends for my past transgressions. Prismatology has taught me. Amen. Eh, well, he's obviously a store clerk. Okay. Docent. I'm a docent. Docent. I've never heard that word before. That's cool. Enlightenment is the only way to reach the Oh, shut up. <laughs> How about we enlighten your skull a little? Would that work? The blister mm -hmm. is through that little box right over there. Huh? Well, for real? Okay. <laughs> Have you seen him? Uh, no, he's usually in the blister these days. Oh, We've got important for you to call something a blister and to be in it. Oh, gross. Let's check it out, though. Lovely shirt. Can I get one, Sam? Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I? You don't wear shirts, Max. I can still accumulate them, can I? Oh, to be a collector. <laughs> Hypno beam display. Spoon bending talisman. What's this? Looks like a bent spoon with some peanut butter on it. The power to bend and rebend spoons stored within this completely indestructible magical talisman was among the first mental abilities. It's a jar. And popularized by Hugh Bliss. Big deal. I can bend spoons with my bare hands. One question. Would it work on red? I just remembered that I didn't put the subtitles on. Uh <laughs> There we go. <clears throat> Actually no, I don't want the background. I like it like this. And mm, yeah. All right. 
credentials close enough. <coughs> interesting, interesting. Ah, you made me forget where I was. Let's see. Oh, indestructible vertical display. Oh, yeah. The virtually indestructible display case is a triumph of modern prismatological science. Hmm. He got it at Walmart, AC. Extensive testing has been done on the case, showing it to be impervious to bullets, acid, high falls, crushing force, sonic weaponry, diving tip drills, hurricanes, poisons, cynicism. Oh, wow. <laughs> Don't touch it. You might break it. Oops. It's not held down very securely. Clink. Oh, no. You should have let it... Oh. We have it now. What's supposed to go here? These hypnotic goggles <clears throat> were an early prototype of the hypnobeam technology mm. currently being used to further the worldwide goals of prismatology. Brainwashing. Wow, invisible goggles! The goggles were stolen a few months ago. Honestly, some people will take anything that's not bolted to the floor. <laughs> uh, <laughs> like cheap touristy crap is the same everywhere in the solar system. Can we get some cheap touristy crap, Sam? No. Please, no. Hugh Bliss's master plan. What's with the charge? Uh. <laughs> how Justin Timberlake is descended from <laughs> people. This chart outlines Hugh Bliss's and Jesus. Uh, uh, yeah, they should have put that part on the side right here. Hmm. You're right. He was? I wonder why I didn't know anything about this at the time. Oh, no wonder he's so small. He was in a big suit, that's One why moment, please. Oh. I'm supposed to frisk everybody when they leave. Just a formality. Of course. Oh, what's this? <clears throat> Nothing. I knew you were up to something. Ruining my career with the toy mafia wasn't enough. Now you want to cost me this job too? Is he really paying you that much to stand here on the moon? What mafia? Don't try that again, or I'll have to get ugly. I guess a lot of people have done it already. Yes, but I also. <laughs> okay, so this is our first thing we have to figure out. Can I check around first? Oh, here's a suit. Oh look, there's a slightly beat up robotic exoskeleton in the trash. The past is only useful as fertilizer for the future. You bliss said that. Uh -huh. Oh, hello. It's you, Super Bowl. <laughs> hey, small girls. It's our favorite cabinet secretary and secret service man, Agent Super Bowl. Favorite? That would be like choosing a favorite child, Sam. I love them all. Didn't I see you have children? The Secretary of Defense over <laughs> with his own war agenda. Granted, it's a tough love. Greetings, newcomers. Blessed be. Oh, you're very prismatic, I see. <clears throat> eh. You? You're studying this prismatology too? Not studying. I've mastered it. Uh, oh. Mastered prismatology by standing in front of a door. <laughs> Looks I like all these guys do is stand. Indigo wavelength of reality. The door is an illusion. Oh. Well. This prismatology nonsense really works for you. Wouldn't that That's mean right. we could just go right through it then? Hubliss is great. I'm sorry. I'm gushing. <laughs> President Max requires an audience with you, Bliss. I can't let just anyone into the retreat. Orders. Well, as your president, here's your new order. Move it! I'm now a citizen of Bliss, sir. Oh, Don't we have jurisdiction over the moon? What about loyalty to your president? Let us in. Hugh Bliss showed me the folly of independent nations. Oh. Plus the benefits are better. Full medical and dental. Oh. <laughs> Damn it. That's a good point. Okay, I'll leave you alone. Oh, hello. No parking between the hours of 3 a.m. <laughs> Male Chrysium Dude Ranch? Ho oh, Mayor. Sorry. Uh. <laughs> mayor, Mayor Chrysium. That's what I read. Well, uh, let me see if I. Oh! These look oddly familiar. They do. These look oddly familiar. Can I not touch. Can I not get? I really should work on securing <clears throat> this thing better. Let's put that in our pocket and get this. Lovely shirt. No. 
face look oddly familiar. Oh, right. I can touch things with other things. I need to get the case off it first. Eh? <laughs> Uh I'll need to get the case off it first. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Put it Oh, wait. <laughs> Let me put it back and see if it's really truly bulletproof. Put it here. As it would be to mix up the okay. <laughs> Shut up, bonehead. Oh, to have someone to lovingly say shut up to. It's great, isn't it? Alright. Let's try looking at this stuff first. What kind of currency do they use on the moon? Junkets. How appropriate. Hmm. Hmm. One moment, oh, sorry. Ew. Okay. Uh. Sorry, I don't know why that was my reaction. Uh, it, mm -mm. <laughs> well, okay, so I should come back. Get off of me, ew, gross. I need something to take the case off. Door? Nope, I guess we really can, but we can continue the conversation. Retreat. Affirmative. I have a passion for it, sir. And Hugh Bliss believed in my door guarding abilities when no one else would. Great story, <laughs> great story. Okay, let us in. Negative. Only level red prismatologist can enter. Level red. Paradise. Oh, a level oh. red prismatologist. Because I'm pretty sure I am one. Level red is apex of prismatology, sir. You'd have to ah. undergo to determine your current level. Okay. Is that where you lie perfectly still in a lead coffin while brightly colored cotton swabs are inserted into various orifices? What? No, sir. We gave that up in eight What? Uh, I'll just leave that at that. Let's see if we can't... Just... Okay, no. No, no, no. Did I see this already? I think that's a satellite. Ah. Oh. The flag. How does it do that when there's no wind on the moon? Actually, okay, yeah. When it's like this, true. But the when you, I saw a video of when they the footage of the astronauts putting the flag on the moon. It wasn't really waving in the wind, you know, no wind. But because of like them holding it and moving it and causing the vibrations through the pole, that's what made it look like it was, you know, flap, flapping. Lunar lander. I thought we used this to get here. That's why I didn't check it. Uh, hmm. Is there nothing in the mechanical suit? Skanky. Okay, time to think. <laughs> I have a gun. He keeps striking me. Can't go through here until I get my prisma color checked or whatever. Oh, can I just check it though? There's nothing behind the curtain. Ah. Blister of tranquility. Okay. <clears throat> One moment. Ah, uh, don't. Okay, go ahead. Oh, chart. Oh, chart. Apparently, he could have come up to the moon and read all about it. Hmm, a spoon. Why don't I already take one though? Okay. What am I missing? Spellbinding. <laughs> I 
I don't think my gun is going to work. So let's just take it again. Really should work on securing this thing better. And let's try it on various things in the room. We'll need to get the case off it first. Mm, I already tried that. Hilarious as it would be. It would be funny. Look at the chart. We'll need to get the case off it first. Hmm. I'll need to get the case off it first. Hmm. Here, Max, hold it. <laughs> I meant in your hands, but whatever. Okay, I see. One moment, please. Okay, go ahead. That was uh surprisingly right in front of my face. Ta da! Could I have that display Open. Ah. Can you wait 12 to 72 hours? No. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> he won't die, right? Okay. Just kidding. <laughs> I know. Well, we have the spoon now. And I guess that'll come in handy later. Mm. But now... I just have the spoon. <laughs> I just have a display. These look oddly familiar. <clears throat> okay. One moment, please. Okay, yeah. So where can we get probed? Hello, Super Ball. Oh. Level red. Let us in. I'm sure you're mistaken, but we'll run the spectrum analysis anyway. Take this. A unicorn? What am I supposed to do with this? Rub it, sir. Rub it. Mm. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Sorry, sir. The Level yellow is frankly rather pathetic, sir. Oh, reds may enter the retreat. Regulations. Hmm. However, Hugh Bliss would like you to keep the unicorn as a token of his love. Rub it uh. your progress towards true bliss. Oh boy, a pet unicorn! I no! <laughs> uh, well, let's look into it. Bye, magic, sir. All right. Either that, or it's just a glorified mood ring that reacts to body heat. A mood horn. You're not a believer, sir. I can <laughs> explain it to you. Uh, okay. Oh, we'll look for a source of heat, I guess. <laughs> Sorry, the unicorn says you're yellow. It's, skanky. it's not wrong. It <laughs> well. -uh. Okay. How about you? Rub it. No. <laughs> no, I'm not that good. No. <laughs> ah, dirty, dirty. Put it here. No, don't not in the store. Nasty. I just wanted you to put it on the display. Hmm. Nope. What appear? Beep, beep, beep. No. No. Nah. Nope. <clears throat> One moment, please. Get out. Okay. Go ahead. Well, what if I just give it to Max to eat again, and then it becomes warm? Hey Max, wanna pet the unicorn? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hey. Oh. Well, I don't want to kill Horny. Same here, man. <laughs> Can I turn it on? Mm. Can I like activate it via satellite or satellite. you know what? I think it is too. Pew! 
Piu! Piu! Hmm. <clears throat> Will it explode? No. So I need to become red. Warning. Wild lunar yaks oh. have been sighted in this area. If you encounter a wild lunar yak, try to make yourself look large, then shriek like a schoolgirl and hightail it for the hills. Okay. I want to know who wrote that, first of all. Hmm. Oh, does my car engine go? Wait, can we go back to Earth? <gasps> Hell yeah, okay. I didn't know we could go back. Great. Secret serve ice cream. Okay. <laughs> spanky. Big spanky devlin. Sunday at the Terror Dome. Big spanky devlin. <laughs> I needed to hear that. You beat your record, Max. Lost cat musty. Okay, okay. Oh. Uh, let me just see. I know it's deserted, but... Except for the lingering stench, of course. Oh, be a be real quick. Just gotta call someone. Hello. <laughs> My brother apparently took the wrong bus home from school today. Happy first day of school. <laughs> uh, now my mom's like all, all panicked and stuff, but it is okay. I did that as well when I was in um when I was in middle school. <laughs> She's freaking out. But yeah. I took the wrong bus because I was too socially aloof to ask anyone if I was on the right bus. I didn't see any of my neighbors on that bus and I just assumed it was the right bus. And 
At the end of the bus trip, I was the last one in the bus, and the, the bus driver was like, is, is this not your stop? And I'm like, no. <laughs> no. And he was like, I'll take you back to school. Call your parents. And yeah, it was okay. You know, it's always okay in the end. Oh, for our unicorn. My nose is already sufficiently blown. Along with your chance to take Melanie Prendergast to the prom. But who's counting? <laughs> Why has it become Canadian in here? By the way. Hello, Sam. Hello, Max. But we prefer to be addressed by our official title. Is Sybil hearing the voices again? The people. The people. You feeling all right, Sybil? You bet we are. We just got the best job ever. We huh? are the Queen of Canada. Huh? <laughs> I always thought Russ was the Queen of Canada. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Queen of Canada? How'd you land that gig? Did you find half of an old locket dripping with syrup and bacon grease hinting at a long forgotten lineage? <laughs> Nothing that interesting, we're afraid. We answered a classified ad. Yeah, the Canadians are practical that way. They've been looking for a figurehead to give the country a little bit more class. Mm. They said we were the perfect candidate. Uh, <laughs> what do you do? I don't care that you're not Canadian. It's mostly promotional. We throw out the first puck in hockey games. Uh. This afternoon, we've got to go pose for money. Sam, how come I don't get to pose? We <laughs> already talked about this, Max. Your gruesome head frightens <laughs> shopkeepers and plays havoc with ATMs. Our most important job is to look for ways to spruce up the country. Hmm. How can you spruce up Canada? There are already spruce many Canada. spruce. It's a paradise year round, from the fresh air and great seafood of British Columbia to the bustling metropolises in Ontario and Quebec. Do you still have that endorsement with the tourism board? Every little bit helps make ends meet, Max, with the rate you go through new shoes. I didn't complain when you were teething, Sam. <laughs> You're not even Canadian, are you? <coughs> Heck no. But we took two quarters of French in college and we spelled couleur with a U. If not <laughs> knowing how to spell is enough to become royalty, I could become <gasps> of the United States. Guess what? My <laughs> god, you're right, Sam. How come I'm not bombing anything right now? Surprising. We were the only candidate. Hmm. Oh, well, we can do tasks. Can with your monarchy? We could be <clears throat> Thanks for the offer, guys, but we've got things under control for now. You're helping a lot just by not making any of the obvious Canada jokes. <laughs> we make obvious jokes, eh? Yes, yeah, Sybil. That's just not what we're about. <laughs> See you later, Your Majesty. You may go. <laughs> well. Maybe. Relax, eh? Sorry, too busy. Here. Nothing special. Can I open? It's locked. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry, I just oh. Her Royal Majesty, Civil Pandemic. Okay. Sorry, I just wanted to look around your room a little more. Why are you in the U.S.? Canada. How come you're still down here in the states? Are you kidding? It's freezing up there. <laughs> we love our country, but we've got to draw the line somewhere. Uh, Have you come up with any brilliant ideas for improving Canada? Nothing solid yet. We thought of a new <clears throat> slogan. Canada. It's surprisingly pleasant. But we need something bigger. Something to really put us on the map. Mm. See you later, Your Majesty. Well, do you want to... We have people who do that sort of thing for us now. <laughs> wow. Let me meet one of them. Well, I guess we'll come back. She's relevant somehow. Queen! <laughs> Let's see. Liver versus onions boxing. Exploitation arena. <clears throat> Let's check out Bosco's, cause we know shit's go. What's wrong? Hi, Jimmy. Up to no good as usual, I see. Better, Buzz. 
get your own meter. I think we already <laughs> did. The city made us pay for that one when we bent it. What do you mean we, White Rabbit? Uh -huh. Oh, let's check the news. And a sister destroy internet. A sister. <laughs> Reality 2.0, up and coming new internet sensation. <laughs> the newspapers are always a little behind in their technology <clears throat> My bad. <laughs> More Lost Brothers stuff. Well, I'll be. The gumball machine actually contains gumballs. <gasps> Did this always have really bad food on the side? Wow. Stinkies. It's finally up and running. Coelacanth. The other in day trip. Hey, boss. Oh. Hey, lady, we're looking for Bosco. You know him? Of course. He's my son. You're your own mother? Is there no escaping these infernal time travel paradoxes? Oh, dear. Bosco. Why? Their right mind would dress up as their own mother. No one. Good point. Mm. Look at me when I'm talking to you. Just for that, I'm not gonna tell you why I dress up as her. Oh come on! We're only you just cost yourself dessert, mister. Ooh, speaking of dessert, I forgot to get cheesecake a while ago. Ah, I should get it later. How's life as a woman? So how are those Bosco Tech breasts holding up? Take out the old father. Okay, you just cross the line, pal. Easy, Max. <laughs> Theoretically, we have even more disturbed people to worry about right now. <clears throat> well, let's see what's up. Buy something. Did you finish all your chores? Yeah. Yes. Okay, you can get one thing. <laughs> uh. My little angel made the most precious device. Oh. An earthquake maker. And it's just what you think. A diarrhea inducing cocktail? <laughs> Max, why can't you be more like your brother? Oh, like your brother. mama. <laughs> I don't want you hanging around with him. 
But he's our bad influence. I'm sure it's quite reasonable, but how much for this earthquake maker? A hundred trillion dollars. <clears throat> you crazy fool! <laughs> All I know is I keep making up the most ridiculous price I can think of. You know? You keep paying it. True. So I ask you, who's the crazy one? We've enabled him all this time. How can we not buy it? Remember, no earthquakes in the house. No. Uh let's see. Can we even sell anything? We've collected some pretty valuable merchandise on our travels. And we have the sneaking suspicion you've got a little extra spending money. <laughs> How'd you like to buy something for Not like we saw your bank account or anything. Do you have any copies of the uncensored 1982 Armand <gasps> You are in luck. <laughs> oh So long. Yeah, we'll check it out later, actually. <clears throat> yep, still a garbage can. Aww. I'm gonna miss this convenience store. Chimps. And bathroom. Freezer. Oh. Actually. Why don't we just put in the microwave? Doesn't that make sense? I know one way to get horny hot. <laughs> I don't want to get hot and horny to- Ah, uh, that's not what she said? <laughs> Ta-da! Success. His little horn's nice and red. Wow. I can't believe the microwave is a high-level prismatologist. Woohoo! Let's go back to the moon. I don't think it's, like, timed or anything. It's not gonna cool down, so... Let's check our office first. Just trash. Ta da! Oh, this game makes me so happy. Look at all our collectibles. The pro behind Brady Culture's unfashionable hypnosis plot. And our man. Did you defeat Leonard today, Max? Sure. Let me rephrase that. What have you been feeding him? You know, bits of string, leftover screws, scraps of paper I find lying around the office. This morning I fed him something that said, D to the United States of America. Look tasty. Well. <laughs> Anybody home? Guess not. Well, what do you know? The crucial piece of evidence in the Hudson River Merman Strangler case. The what? File that once we're done with this case. All right, next thing, let's go. <laughs> Bye. <clears throat> All right, back to the moon. Back to the moon. I'm sure we'll have something to do with Canada now, and that guy that we saw on the moon. You know, the, the male camp one. Mare camp. <clears throat> moon, 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 moon. Let's go. Let's go. Hi. <laughs> Here's my red prismatology thing. Have you achieved level red yet? Yes. I'm utterly flabbergasted, sir. I'd suspect a trick, but surely no level red prismatologist would stoop. So true, bad. true, true. Never stoop. We're posture freaks. Enjoy the retreat, brothers. Woohoo! <laughs> the game just ends. It's just a box. <laughs> uh, I bet it's some elevator or some... No, it's magic. I guess. Oh, it's magic. Sam, Sam, there he is. It's Hugh Bliss. Hi. Oh my god. Oh my god, Jesus. You're enjoying my blister of tranquility. You're all making such great progress unlocking the secrets of prismatology. 
That box was probably laced with something, huh? Mm. <laughs> Sorry. Jesus. <laughs> Upstairs neighbors calling nine one. That's right, the best kind. He has uh. to my inner sanctum. Thank you. <laughs> Mr. Spatula, so this is where you've been. We were worried. No, our fish is a prismatologist. Fuck. He sent us an email. I meant to tell you. Lincoln? It's the giant stone head of your old opponent, Abraham Lincoln. Welcome, brethren, to the blister of... Oh, it's you. Not so tough without your fancy giant <laughs> robot body, are you? I can still bite off your fluffy little... I mean... Let me help you, brother, to overcome the orange of confrontation. <laughs> bathe in the yellow... Does that mean he's not hypnotized bathe yet? In the yellow? What kind of camp is this? That's your problem. You're not still bitter about the election, are you? Or your public humiliation? Or the cruise missile that blew your body to tiny wig bits? Huh? <laughs> what did you call him? Chumps. Only a grade A sociopathic masochist would want that thing. Grade A? I'm flattered. <laughs> Oops. <clears throat> mm. So why are you upset? than an election my one chance at true love what he didn't like her anyway moron i'm talking about that radiant vision of beauty you had interrupt my family you said you had a wife you mean sybil is that her name sybil it's like a chorus of angels aren't you married what about mary your mannish but devoted wife why don't you find a nice giant statue of her? Settle down and start cranking out little bouncing baby war memorials. <laughs> on left, Lady Bird Johnson had all graven images of former first ladies destroyed during the Great Enlightenment. Aww. Well, how can a head find love? How can you expect to have a complete relationship with someone when you're well, missing some key sub neck accoutrements? <clears throat> You gonna make time with the <laughs> You're just ahead. Obviously, you two never read. <gasps> oh my god, Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Nasty. Chapter 6 is the dirtiest of them all. The miraculous power of gastrokinesis. You can teleport human dictators? Well, yes, but now I'm working on gastrokinesis. <laughs> Ability to make anyone throw up with my mind. Max and I are always looking for new ways to make people throw up. Teach us. Please. <laughs> As it is now, I can make boy. people vomit with every part of my body except my mind. Well, if you are a true prismatologist, I suppose I'm obliged to help you. But there's a problem. I accidentally swallowed the gastrokinesis talisman. Where does it go? Ironic or sarcastic? It's pretty damn Where does it go? It should just be right. Can't you huh? yourself throw up the gastrokinesis talisman? I haven't thrown up since 18. <laughs> right after I gave the address. I was kind of nervous that day. I didn't have anything prepared. <laughs> Oh, sorry, I play I I burp, 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 burp. <clears throat> Oh, sorry, I also did that. Uh well we will make him throw up somehow. Uh, we don't have anything on us. What happened to that spoon? Oh the spoon 
this with him? Okay. Shark. They have sharks in the Blister of Tranquility? All devoted practitioners are welcome. Hmm. Uh, forgot what these were called. They don't sound very happy to see us. You destroyed reality 2.0. Well, at least you're in 1.0 now. Adopt a more now. <clears throat> Play your motivational song. <laughs> Why, Sam? Why? Has us we no longer need self oh. We have looked inside ourselves. And we totally rock. But why are you here? came to a private retreat on the moon to work on something as insubstantial as a video game? Not just any game. Of course. Do you get to shoot stuff? In a world. You get to shoot stuff? Thank you for your feedback. We will incorporate shooting into version 2.0. Oh, we can try it. Max and I'll try out this video game of yours. Prepare to suffer extreme humiliation! The year is 2048. In a post-apocalyptic galaxy run by giant corporations, you are a cybernetic man and space marine with no memory of his past. As the chosen one foretold by prophecy, do you have the strength to survive? Ah, dude. It's just like Halo. I don't know how to play tic-tac-toe, by the way. Corners, right? C -c 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 Corners. I did it. <laughs> the graphics weren't good. I hate it. You didn't let me shoot an apple on the side of the road. Bad game. I think that's the biggest, meanest looking spork I ever saw outside of Chicago. I never understand modern art. Yeah, it's ugly, isn't it? Can we stand? Oh, I don't want to go anywhere else yet. Oh. This must go all the way down to the center of the moon. What's down there? Looks like nougat. <laughs> yum yum. <clears throat> Abe Lincoln eats pussy. <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> he read it in Cosmo. How are you, Mr. Featherly? I mean, he's right. You only need a head to... He's annoying. You mean you don't even know? The show was cancelled almost immediately after your first and only appearance. All that flap over the tabloid photos of you two with that sensors down on us. That was no alien, it was Hugh. The show was ruined. He doesn't care. Max is president. <laughs> Why prismatology? prismatology? You don't seem like the type. It's an excellent networking opportunity for an <laughs> yes, this place Of course. Is littered with Hollywood luminaries. Ordinarily it is. I believe there's a party at Kevin Bacon's home this evening. Oh. So everyone is there. <laughs> How about this? Are you going to do a magic trick? New opportunities in the entertainment field. What are you pulling rabbits out of it? Rats. Uh. Or at least I'm trying to. 
Oh. <laughs> you can't pull the rat out. Yeah, the rat out of the hat trick isn't going so well. The principles involved are quite simple. I could even teach them to adult like you. Meanie. But I'm having trouble getting the rat all the way out. It appears to be stuck. The rat's stuck in the hat. Has the rat been stuck in the hat? You misunderstand. The rat is not actually in the hat. It's stuck somewhere else. The hat is acting as a dimensional portal to wherever the rat happens to be. Wow. Hmm. Is it magic or science? Is that really any different? <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean... You teach me how to pull a rat out of a hat? Bismatology instructs us to share. Good. But I've simply got to perform the trick successfully myself oh. first. Oh, okay. So we have to oh, get him off of the... Catch you later, off of the pole. My name is oh, I hate... <laughs> uh, hut. Those must be the restrooms. Please, those are tint adjustment chambers. They're Hello, what? <laughs> This is a pool of artificially flavored mm. No cult should be without one. Oh no. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh no. Ah, bad. Bad. I've never seen ants meditating before. You must be at least this this tall. Be at least this tall to ride this ride. Fascist oppressor. Uh should we go on the roller coaster? Oops. Well, there seems to be a lot to do. But we can't do this for now. Hideous you head. Oh, oh my god. Yeah. I think it depends on which way you're facing. Well, let's not take the elevator yet. It might take us away. <clears throat> Oh, I I assumed we could get in. Wow, isn't that neat? Can we get in now? Kaleidoscope. Or swallow the inevitable gruesome consequences? Huh? <laughs> wow, cute. Oh. Well, we have to do something with that. I thought Max was gonna throw up or something. Uh, so we have get the rat off and then the head over there. Going up to this inner sanctum. Oh, ooh, ooh. That's certainly an important looking door. I wonder what's behind it. Something really secret or something really ugly, I'm guessing. Both. Really ugly secret. One can only hope. What would red? What it became red? True, but only in an inanimate object kind of way. <clears throat> okay, nothing here then. <laughs> Can we get Abraham Lincoln on the roller coaster ride so he throws up? Can we do anything with the water? Throw up. Wait, I read that already. We can give you Sybil's phone number so you can set up a date. I haven't dated in over 150 years. I wouldn't know what to say. Phone, Max. <gasps> Hello. If you'd like to make a love connection, press or press wow. now. Just follow my lead, Mr. Lincoln. Hello? Civil Pandemic speaking. Um, hi. It's Abraham Lincoln. Oh. Got oh, yeah. After how you treated me. Wait, don't hang up. <laughs> I got needs, baby. Lincoln plus civil equals ecstasy. I'm issuing a romancipation proclamation. Or just relax, baby. Hmm. 
this one. I'm issuing you a romancipation proclamation. Let's set aside our differences and oh, oh, oh. instruction. No. Let's try okay. I want to try the last one. Just because it's on her in her office. Just relax, baby. Think positive and you ain't gonna make it all Oh, you're almost as hot as your sister. Ah, oh, Jesus. Lady, you're a stone-cold fox. Girl, you got curves like a racetrack. Woman, you got a body that won't quit. Hmm. She does like to work. Woman, you got a body that just won't quit. No! Okay, try again. This is fun. I mean, to be fair, he's right, and everyone should be doing it. True, actually. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna romance her the right way. With words from the mouth. Yes. Hmm. She do be kind of... Maybe Fox. head all over your body play some one-on-one -on -one love hockey or lie down and get psychoanalyzed we'll get alone together stretch out on the couch and oh no <laughs> no ah uh, she doesn't like psychotherapy anymore well let's run canada together i guess is that what she wants? Just relax. <clears throat> and you, Fox. And... Well, I mean, hockey is the closest thing to Canada. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Did he actually say yes? Hello, you just totally. Thank you. Go get that puss. What if she wants to get serious? I can't do this. I'm so nervous. I got butterflies. Throw up. Where? back, man. Wherever they are, I have a feeling they're coming back up. Ooh. I don't feel so good. What if she? And I can't. Oh. That's. I'm not sure why you'd want to use the power of prismatology. That's the power of prismatology. Oh, right. More important things to worry about. It's the throw up part of it. Okay. So. Ah, right. Bop. Come here. Come here. What? Yay. Hey, it's that display case. Thanks, little pal. Oh, I was saving that. <laughs> it's complicated, but it has to do with my personal vendetta against a certain major coffee house chain. Oh, gross. <laughs> I don't get that. <laughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> well, we have the spoon now. It's a spoon. Hmm. Hmm. 
What if I just make everyone throw up? I'm not particularly interested in seeing Okay. <laughs> oh. Would he be interested in the special prisma spoon? Get the case off it first. Right. Okay. Let's go to Earth. <clears throat> See if we can't do anything with Jimmy Two Teeth. Well, we have that, we have- oh. Throw up. Okay. I guess we don't make everyone throw up, which is valid. Okay, yes, okay. Just wondering. <clears throat> To the earth. Oh. Hmm. He said that very nicely. So, oh, well, let's see how Sybil feels about her date. Oh, Canada. Hiya, Sybil. Hello, Sam. Hello, Max. Oh, yes. All yes. We, I always thought Rush would oh. Come up with any brilliant Nothing solid. We've yet. thought of it, but we need some. Okay. So you same diff. You may... <clears throat> <laughs> you may go. Be gone. Mm, we still also need a hundred billion trillion dollars. Are you really stuck here? That meter's been out of order for years. Just cause it ain't working, that don't mean people don't put money in it. It's like an HMO. I'm not particularly. No. Interested. Why? Get off. I don't know. Okay. Do you wanna... <laughs> Aww. Hmm. Well, are you interested in this? No, you are not. Okay. Maybe boss goes... <clears throat> I'm sorry, Danny, but it's very, very late and I'm super sleepy. It's okay. Understandable. You have a good rest. I'll talk to you later. I'm not particularly interested in seeing the contents of his stomach. I'll need to get the case off it first. Hmm. <clears throat> Actually, now that I'm here, I think I will end stream because I have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> have a good stream. I'm gonna go to sleep. Good night, good night, good night. Have a good rest, sweet dreams. I'll go ahead and end it off here too. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, oh. Have a good day, thank you. Have a good night. <clears throat> yeah, 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 yeah. Oh wait, I should save my game. Alright, that's good progress though. Pop 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 pop. Wait. Okay, I saved. Good progress. Next time I hope I finish it. But yeah. Da -da -da -da. I'll be ending it here. Bye. <laughs> uh, bye 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 bye.